All right, let's go to do the head to head. The height is a push. The reach two inches in favor of Joel Champion. This was supposed to be 190. Javier Torres did his part. Champion coming over by five pounds. Water under the bridge. By the way, the, the fans here at Tucson may have showed up late, but they don't leave early. Everyone's still here to see the And you final hear act. them. Yeah. Chunti Torres making his debut. Southpaw, black belt in judo, black belt in jiu-jitsu. This guy is That's projected to, to be a stud. All right, here we go, gentlemen. You ready, sir? You ready? Fight! Coming out of MMA lab with John Crouch. Champion in blue. UKF gym. He takes the center of La Jaula. Junti Boy maneuvers. Our champion looks a little jiggly around the belly section. There's that extra five pounds, maybe extra 10. It's like 20. And he better stay on Torres if he expects anything yeah. good to happen. It looks like you can Torres already is, tell Torres, Torres is freaking like a ready to shoot right out of a cannon. He's had a, a good career, a long, a successful career, and he's 34, but his body's not looking like he's 34. And that's a very dangerous guy to have in there, although Champion catches him with a big right hand, and that got the attention of Chunti Boy. That's a good punch. Chunti Boy doing the right thing, circling to, the, to our left, his right. As a southpaw, you don't want to circle to the left. You'll be circling right into Joel's uh, power hand, the right hand. He's doing a good job staying clear of that power side. Champion is lurking. Champion is, is stalking. Uh, Chunty, you can see the weight. I mean, that's a problem right now for Chunty Boy as he is just reacting. Pushing forward again and withdrawing is Junti Boy. I Joel mean, Champion doing a good job staying on his opponent. You also want to see, I mean, you, you would imagine Champion at some point will get tired throwing punches a man that size, but you never know. You don't want to count out a man this size. Look at the new heavyweight champion in the boxing room. First Mexican American That's right. heavyweight champion. A complete. Andy Ruiz. Boom. Can't be counting those big boys out. Cloak and dagger job. He didn't know jump. it was a show. He thought it was a fight. Everyone said that he, there's no way this guy could punch like that or fight like that or have that kind of wind in his sails. So you check, check, check. You never know. Joel Champion could uh, have that wind in his sails. He seems doing, to be doing great I, yeah, we by learned, the looks of it. We all learned a big lesson a week ago right here on DAZN. And you would have missed that fight if you didn't have DAZN. So have DAZN. Oh, that was chalking it up one for the chubby guys. Ooh. Champion misses, and now Chunty Boy takes a more central position here inside La Jaula. Now he can fire off. Listen, uh, Big Ernie, Mr. Thumper. Joel, the Great cage is not, names. or not Joel, uh, Javier, Chunty, the cage is not that big, but he's making it look uh -oh. bigger with the oh, space like that this. he's able to Watch grab. This. Oh, but it, oh, Chunty Boy caught him. Oh, boom. Hey, out of the way, out of the way. And I, Javier is running. Almost a slap to the face. But he's not running. He's just trying to reset himself. And he's doing the right thing. Trying yeah, to do no, that. he's fighting his fight. But you got to like champion. He wants to put on a show. He wants to fight. Look at the way he flicks up that kick up there. Hey. Big overhead. Good hit. Champion. Champion doing a good job of corralling Javier Torres into every way that he wants him. He he knows he wants to circle to the left, our left, his right, and Joel stops him with a big hook or a big leg kick. He wants to go to the right or to uh, Javier's left, and Joel stops him with some hooks and uh, now into the clinch. So every time he tries to circle away from him, Joel does a really good job of corralling him back into the area that he wants him to be in. Except when he's doing this, he doesn't have any choice because the guy keeps backpedaling. Crowley, it's like a good sheepdog. Get in there. Yeah, no, it is. It's like you're trying to hurdle cattle. You're trying to stop them from going to the left and to the right. And Joel has been able to stop uh, Javier in any direction that he goes in by doing that. Good kick, punch combo there from Torres. He's stopping him. He's staying on him too, and that's important as well. Champion looking a little worse for wear, a little bit. Still a long way to go. He's not as explosive as we saw in the opening of this round. Torres level. 
Javier, black belt in jiu-jitsu and judo, but Joel Champion is a brown belt. Here we go. Haymaker City. We'll look over maybe to the clock there from Torres. 30 seconds to go. Overhead nice right. Flurry of punches. Those are all solid. They land. Torres happy to backtrack and set his feet. Ten Joel seconds. staying on him. Wild spinning back fist. Ooh. Close quarters now. Only attempting for the underhook there for Torres. Nice head position by Joel. Oh. Oh boy. Right at the end of the round. Wow. Well, whatever he did, he looks like it, uh, it hurt. Really landed that. Uh, you got five minutes, my friend. Take your five minutes. Oh. Here it is. Good head position, and he paid for it. More belt high than groin, I thought. Yeah, I'm not going to say one way or the other. I don't know how that is. I don't know if it's that all that low. Boom. But hey, far be it for me to. Can we see Judge. another angle? But look at his eyes. I mean, that, those, that's, he's definitely struck. Crack the egg. OK, let's go to round two. <laughs> you never know what you're going to hear. It's informative. About them. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. All right, here we go. Woo, Swinging now. Javier. Better from Torres. He's Boom. not backtracking now. He wants to fight. Yep, I like it. You almost feel like that first reason. They are, he's he's heavy. Let's see, see if he can uh, empty out some of those resources in that first round. Every shot, bad intentions, throwing heavy leather. Javier Torres looking for a knockout. See if he has any huevos in round two. No, he does. Torres, champion caught him there. The head was just standing there asking to be hit. There's a nice frame from Javier. And they're back to the center of the jaula. Yeah, but Torres seems to always end up with his back on the cage. Yeah. Yep. He does. Good straight right from Champion. Is that time to recover from the, the shot at or below the belt? Be careful. You don't want it to happen again. Nice body lock by Javier Torres. He needs to keep that body lock and pull him off the fence, get that takedown. Some knees coming up from Torres. Joel's not able to swim for an underhook. Junti boy. There's the underhook, thank you. And you can see how much physically stronger Champion is. The uh, extra weight that he um, missed is definitely helping him because he was able to reverse Javier back onto the howl fence. But Torres is staying busy, knees to the head. Got that plum tie, another knee, and they're out in the open. Shorty boy, who uh, also played some American football while at school in Mexico. A sport that's growing there. I know when we were in Monterrey, we played, there was a football field right next to. Wait a minute, he's 34 years old? Right. Yes. So he was in school 15 years ago? It says he assisted at the university. So. Ooh, big old left hook from Joel Champion. I'm just trying to figure out when nice. American football was in start of Mexico. <laughs> Big old Probably takedown for Joel, Joel Champion. And he just drops the weight on him. Oh, for sure. There's my phone number again. Any Let last text, get him fight. in now. Come Ui, on. Almost ran an arm bar. Triangle. Triangle, there it Ooh, is. Got to stretch that deeper, arm. Get, OK, it's over. Champion in problems oh, now. Over, over, just over. Just got to extend. It's done, guys. That's a tap by Triangle. Wow, that's impressive from Chunty Boy. And he's still working. There's a tap. You called it, Juliana. For sure, that was way too tight. He almost tricked him. He fell on top, and he goes, that's where I'll take you. I bet you he wished that Joel took him down earlier, so that the fight could have yeah. ended in the first round, because I have a feeling that. It had to work. Joel punched himself into a submission there, getting too aggressive with that takedown, not respecting the ground game of uh, El Chunti Boy, who's a black belt in jiu-jitsu. Uh. Is the ultimate okay, price. pretty good. I, I found that quite entertaining. 11 and 5 for Chunti Boy. What on Combate Medic is a guy again who fought at high levels at Bellator. Now comes in showing he still has a lot to give.
Dang it. Joel, you did great, though. You just made a technical error and it happens, bud. Gotta drop some LBs. T tonight was Javier's night. You get him next time. Nice. Fighting out of the MMA lab. Yep, Javier Torres. That's got to feel good. Your last fight of the night. Now you get to celebrate onto it. Celebrate the times. Come on. All right. And here you go. He fell on top, and that's just where Chunti Boy wanted him. Triangle. His arm was swept right across the belt line of Javier Torres, which is exactly what you need to do in order to complete this triangle. See, he'll pull for it and sweep it across his body, pull onto the shin, and then he's going to cut his angle underneath the legs, hold on to the back of the head. Wow, legs made out of rubber. Hey. Legs that act like arms. Dangerous, dangerous ground game from Javier Torres. Black belt in jiu-jitsu sinks in that triangle. His corner knew it, too. They were clapping before he tapped. Oh, they yeah. knew it was coming. And did you. Nice triangle, nice finish. It's and a way to get it done. That'll come to a close our evening of fights in Tucson. Damas y caballeros de Esquina Roja aplica un triángulo obligando a su rival a darse por vencido con un tiempo oficial de 2 minutos 42 segundos del segundo episodio. Ladies and gentlemen, the red corner sinks in a triangle choke, forcing his opponent to tap with an official time of 2 minutes 42 seconds of round number 2. Your winner, by way of submission, el vencedor por sumisión. De Ciudad Obregón, Sonora, México, el Chunti Boy, Javier.